I just finished this book, Models by Mark Manson, attract women through honesty. And you know, in the back of the book, it says, this is the first and last book on men's dating advice you'll ever need. I agree with that statement for the most part. It's not about tricks and gimmicks to get women in bed. It's be about becoming a more attractive man, about becoming a more vulnerable man who lives honestly. Not only does it talk about the internal aspects of your mindset and all that, it also talks about you should have your fashion and fitness together. It talks about the external as well as the internal to become a more attractive man in general. Being vulnerable, being polarizing so that you identify and filter out all of those who do not jive with you and only let in those who do jive with you. If you've been watching my videos, I've been sharing things that I've been learning from this book over the past days and weeks maybe. Not only is it a very useful and practical book with action steps at the end, it's also an entertainment entertaining book. I was going to initially skip the part at the beginning to get to the practical side of things. Uh, all the how to's and what to do's. But the beginning talking about the mindset and all that was actually really interesting with all the stories. It captivated my attention. It was still useful. It wasn't useless at all. So I read it cover to cover and thoroughly enjoyed it from start to finish. There's so much that I didn't share in my videos that are packed in here that even if you have been watching my videos about what I've been sharing about this book, if you found any of them valuable, then I highly recommend you check this book out. I'm not sponsored or anything. I bought this with my own money and this is just my personal opinion. I think I'll keep coming back to this book and reading parts that I've highlighted again and again when I feel like I'm stuck and I need some guidance when it comes to women. Today I got a comment on one of my videos where I was talking about this book who said, buying a book like this means that you're desperate and desperation is a huge turnoff to women. And I completely agree that desperation is a huge turnoff, but I completely disagree that buying a book like this and reading it is desperation. Learning from a book like this means that you're admitting to yourself that you don't have all the answers and you're willing to learn whatever that skill may be, in this case, dating. You're adopting a self-improvement mindset, not being arrogant that you know it all and that you have nothing to learn, and instead adopting a student mindset that you have more to learn from people who know more than you. And as I said, this book is not just a bunch of tricks and gimmicks to get women into bed. It's about improving yourself and becoming a more attractive person overall. And there are a bunch of useful tools in there that require practice over time, as well as lifestyle tips like having a social hobby that gets you interacting with people on a regular basis while doing something that you enjoy doing. I've spent a lot of money on dating products in the past. And honestly, this book, which was 20 something dollars was, I'd say more value than any of the hundreds or thousands of dollars worth of products out there right now. Of course, the caveat is this book is just a guideline. The main way that you start learning from social interactions is through experience. So Mark Manson, the author says that you should go out and gain a lot of experience and learn from your experience because experience is the best teacher. These just have a few tips to help you along the way while you're doing that. Reviewing my day, I finished watching Dancing with the Stars, the semifinal and final. Jason Raz actually placed second, one of my favorite singer-songwriters. The fact that Jason Raz scored second place, that's that's incredible and I'm happy about that. I did not get around to working out because I've been reading this book until I finished it. So this week I only worked out once on Tuesday gotta get on it. I was writing it in my stream of consciousness writing about strategies, about how to get my workout scheduled in, and the best time is in the morning. Just do it in the morning, get it out of the way. Anyways, here's to 1% better every day, baby. I was sweeping the snow off the steps and while my mom was parking, coming back, she nearly ran over Mochi, our dog. That was really close. That was dangerous because Mochi was out there with me just running around in the snow. Oh man, I'm glad she's okay. Mochi. Mochi. So warm, take her on my lap. So warm. There's a bunny outside, so there's a bunny right there. So Mochi's going crazy. Oh, Mochi. <laughs> 